Hey, what's up everyone? Glock9 here and welcome back to New Frontier. It's the morning of day 24. I've got the black thick 44 flag hanging up. It looks pretty sick in between the cow skulls, right? I also have a couple of skill points to spend this morning. I'm going to put one into strength so I can put another one into boomstick. Now, the first thing we are doing this morning is heading back across the street to the Snakebite Saloon to see what's behind those doors I never opened, because I know if I don't, I'll never hear the end of it. Uh, also, I wanted to mention the stats on that level 5 mini machete in the last episode. A lot of you guys called it out. The stats were like 800 melee damage or something. I went back and checked, and yeah, it showed that in the video. So I was messing around with this level 6. I put this mod into it, and I got the numbers to jump up to 800 again. But then I took the mod out, and I put it back in, and the numbers went back to normal, and I couldn't replicate that again. So I think it was just a little glitch. There's no way the stats on a level 5 mini machete were 800 points of damage. Just a weird glitch that's happening. So um, anyway, I'm sticking with the level 6 large machete. Now let's head over to this saloon here. I got some uh, dynamite and time charges and we'll blow open the doors that I never opened. A couple of them we don't have to bother with because they just lead to the rooms we've already been in. But I know of one I want to try first. It's over here. In this room, I believe. Yeah, this one. Because this one just leads to the other room that's through there. So let's uh, blow this door open and see what's hiding behind it. We'll start with the dynamite. Here we go. Ow. Well, that guy timed that perfectly. There's another one in there. There's loot in there too, though, so I don't want him blowing up. No, oh, you can blow up out here. I don't care about that. Alright, I think we're clear in here. We got some loot and another friggin' door. Salvage tool crafting. All gambling debts must be settled. I agree with that. If you're gonna make a bet, you better be prepared to pay up if you lose. Otherwise, it's the gallows for you, bitch. All right, try the key. Nope. Uh, scrap that. Read that. And uh, let's blow this one open. They keep coming down that ladder, which leads me to believe this is the way out. This has got to be the shed with the barrels. It is. I knew there was something weird going on here. And that's what it was. That was the hatch leading down to the basement. All right, that's it. There was a couple of other doors in there, but they just led to the other rooms that I'd been in already. So, Snakebite Saloon is done. Fuck off, dog. Let's go find us a base location. We need to figure that out today. So we can uh, get working on it or planning it. Not much going on in this little crater town. I thought there'd be more here. Kerosene factory? I don't know about that. All these buildings are wood. It's going to be quite a lot of upgrading I'm going to have to do. The mine? Hey, that's an idea. Can fight the horde underground. Haven't done that in a while. That's a weird POI over there. The power plant or whatever that is. Um, let's see what's over here. Is there anything? I feel like there's got to be more in this crater. Oh, is this the actual crater right here? Look, it goes down even further. What is that? Something else. Let's go check it out. All right, fine. I'm dropping in. All right, with the snakes. I've had enough snakes. I feel like Indiana Jones. Um, anything in the corner here? I don't think so. That's locked. There's a key. Oh, that one actually worked. Get out of here, lady. What else we got? Oh, it goes down even further. Oh, shit. Didn't see you, lady. Ow. Stop it. 
Tools Digest, and I'll read that again. I'm not holding on to it. All right, I guess we're going to go down. Whoops. Okay. This is going to be fun. Uh-oh. Yep. Oh, shit. Well, everyone's awake now. I don't know where to run. I don't feel like just standing here, though. That's not a good idea. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Uh, I'm going back the way I came. <laughs> Running uh, blind into a cave is not probably a good idea. Shit, shit, shit. Yeah, fuckers. I love this pistol. Sweet. That bird is driving me insane. Should have killed it before I drop down here. Here's another one. All right, let's uh, reload. Here's another snake. Oh, some loot. Urban combat. Take less damage, deal more when indoors. Does being in a cave count as indoors? Ah, excuse me, lady. Let me just jump over you here. Oh. Friggin' snakes, man. Whoever made this mod just loves snakes. They probably have a pet snake. They have a snake shrine in their bedroom. Let me tell you something about your pet snake. It doesn't love you back. It just hasn't figured out how to eat you yet. Oh, is this way out? Please be the way out. Yes, because I am done being underground. Hey, bat. At least we can eat the bats. Come on. Don't be shy. This goes down even further, huh? What's going on down here? I guess I'm gonna push on down. This looks sketchy. Oh! Yeah, this is totally sketchy. I probably shouldn't be doing this, but here I go. Dear, you better get out of here. This ain't a place for you. This is dangerous down here. You can get killed by someone like me. So, beat it. Oh, blue crystal. What can we do with that? Blue crystal battery. That's interesting. Let's get a little more. Well, I don't know what the hell this thing is. But chicken! Got it. This seems like, uh, endgame stuff here. So, probably should be, uh... Oh, stupid bat. Probably should be better armed. I mean, I... Uh, I mean, whatever, right? I got a shotgun. I'm fine. Is this the blue crystal again? Yep. I'll have to see about making one of them batteries. I wonder if we can get power from that battery or if we have to use it in, like, a battery bank. I mean, I haven't even thought about electricity or traps or any of that kind of stuff here. There's some more of the green crystal. Let me grab some more of this stuff, even though right now I think it's useless because I pointed this out in, like, the last episode. You can craft whip. At the chemistry station, which... Oh, fucking bird. Uh, which apparently stands for work in progress. Um, you know, my brain just uh, doesn't function all that well sometimes. So, oh, look at this. We got some crazy chickens in there. Uh, let's load this bad boy up. And shoot him. That seems like the best idea. Oh, 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 there's uh, quite a few of them. Yep, yeah, yep, yeah, fuck this thing. Nope, not the bow. There we go, that thing shit out of loot bag. Ow, what was that? Something got me. Die, bitch. Hey, another loot bag. I think it was that crawler that got me before. Oh, 
Another loot bag. This is nice. Look at this little baby. Oh, shit. The little baby chickens seem completely defenseless now. Compared to the big ones. Yoink. Ow. Oh, God. Well, I'm just being completely reckless here. Is that thing radiated, or is that green glow coming from somewhere else? Ooh, level six steel boots. It's a nice find. Get out of here, you little shit. It sounds like there's a lot of them in there. I like that they're coming out a little at a time now. That helps me out. And it sounds like there's a bear in there also. So we better be prepared for that. Another snake. Surprise, surprise. Get out of here. Even though they're little, I don't want to go after them with the... with the machete. You don't want to get close to them. Come on! Jeez, I'm getting my ass beat. Alright. Probably should use some first aid. There's that bear. Shit, shit, shit. Shit, shit, shit! Oh, no. Got him. I got him. I'm winning. I'm the winner. I'm still alive, so I win. Look at this. U.S. mail. They'll fucking deliver anywhere, huh? I think this one's stuck. Get out of here, bat. No, it's not stuck. It's not stuck! I wasn't scared. You were scared. Oh, what was that? Another snake? Yeah, but that's not what got me. Oh, it's a crazy little chicken. Ow! That time it was a snake. Oh, shit! We're being fired upon! Is that that white gunslinger? I don't have my 666 pistol. Oh god. Yep. That's definitely him. I guess we're not gonna uh, fulfill the contract because I'm gonna kill him with this shotgun. All right. Holy shit. Who would have thought this weird, devilish, insane-looking rock formation in the middle of a crater would be a dangerous place? Oh, give me this loot bag. Of course there's cornmeal in here. I'm going to eat the meat stew now. That'll fill us up and give us a... Good amount of health back. That was nice. Alright, what else is in here? More stuffs. There's a ladder going up. Holy shit. Well, come on out, bear. This son of a bitch is going to make me go back in there, isn't he? Oh, you got smoked. All right, are we good? Are we clear? Is that it? That wasn't so bad. Tools Digest, and Armor Piercing Ammo for the 7.62, or in this mod, it is the uh, 50-90 Sharps. Well, I want to head up that ladder and see if there's anything going on up here. Any more loot or what have you. Whoops. There's some more loot. Scrap the bolts, take the shotgun shells. Scrap the nails, take the parts. The 
take that. Scrap those. We can always make more if we need them. Just kind of hoping for a painkiller. I've had this concussion for a while now. I guess we're done here. Should we make this place our base? Huh? Little rock formation crater base? That would just require a lot of work, I think. And they'd just be crawling up on top of the thing and beating down through the ceiling. It would just be a complete and utter mess. It would just be me running around the crater. Which, uh, my other plan that I have is going to be me running around also, so it doesn't really matter. I think it would be more fun, though, to try and make a base out of the underground mine. So, that is the plan, I think. Let's get back up to the car, though, and uh, maybe we'll go do that kerosene factory now. What the hell? I got the explosives. Wake up time. Going loud. Don't care. Whoop. Okay. Let's get up here. Oh, but now we're a sitting duck. Don't you puke. Oh, shit. Well, I didn't think they were going to be able to get up there. They totally can get up there. Either of you guys want to blow up? That'd be good. Oh, uh, oh, there's kerosene in here. Uh-oh. Yeah, this is not good. That was a bad decision. Oh, dogs. This is fun. Excuse me. I'd like to get out of here now. Alright, that didn't go great. Uh, let's go back up here. <laughs> or not. You know what? Fuck it. Let's not go up there. Holy shit. Oh, this looks good. We'll bottleneck them. Down this way. Everybody's like, Glock's just trying to end it right now. No, I'm just looking for a good fight. That's all. Haven't had a decent fight in years. Oh, this is perfect back here. Can't bottleneck them any more than this. One block wide. This is beautiful. Line them up. Sweet. Oh, they're breaking through the fence. Excuse me. Yeah, this is great, though. As long as we don't get sandwiched in here, we're going to be just fine. Oh, yeah. A little hallway action. This is why I love hallways. It's my favorite. Fuck you, bird. Let me just uh, make sure they're not coming from the other way because I don't have parkour high enough to where I could jump over this fence. All right, we're good. Here we go. Painkiller. That'll get rid of the concussion. Use a bandage to get rid of the abrasion. And now we need to find a splint or a plaster cast to get rid of this broken leg. Is that crawler dead? Oh, shit. He wasn't dead. Another loot bag. Another painkiller. Hold on to that one. Another loot bag. Eat that. Take everything else. All right, let's hobble our asses through this POI now. See what we can find. All right, let's just try and be aware of where we are shooting because this is the kerosene factory. I guess keys aren't going to work here. That's what I heard. I guess that ain't going to blow up. Yeah, herbal antibiotic, that could come in handy. Can't do anything with that. Let's blow these up. Nice. 
Purchase an office. Upstairs. All right, let's go check it out. And then, uh, I'm assuming we're gonna have to go blow up that hatch and see what's down below. Oh, shit. Wasn't expecting more. Just get him caught on this railing, maybe? Nope. They figured out how to go around. Now, purchasing is behind the door and the key doesn't work. Shit. Oh, shit. <laughs> well, close that. Got him. Oh. It's getting wild. As if it wasn't wild the moment I walked in this place and started shooting. And no splint or cast there. We're going to have to keep on lugging. Now we're destroying everything else here, as well as the door. There's another friggin' door in there. Ah, uh, whatever. Really? That didn't do it? Oh, this is bullshit. Oh, you son of a bitch. Oh, damn it. Really? Ow. Oh, this is so dumb. And when I say this, I mean me. I am so dumb. All right, we're in. At least there's loot inside. Read that, eat that. Vehicle book. This is the mod for the horse that increases its acceleration and top speed. Let's pop this open. All right, let's see what's down here. Probably just a bunch of locked doors. No, well, at least this one's unlocked. Those probably aren't, though. Okay. Close that. Hey, there we go. Finally, not hobbling around anymore. Now we can run if we need to. That's good. We might need to. Takes more of those time charges than I thought to open one of these doors. So I got a feeling we're going to be leaving some locked doors behind here. A little bit of a... Uh, well, not really a maze. There's only one way to go. Another locked door. Hey, there's a zombie. And some more. Nice. Oh, shit. Well, let's lead him down the hallway. Nice. This is good. I like that. We're just going to push to the end. And start with the last door, probably, and then work our way back. Well, all right then. Fuck you. How'd you like that? Pretty sweet, huh? And I didn't even blow up the cement. Let's keep on going down the winding hallway here. Looks like the last couple of doors. Let's uh, start with this one. Oh, we got zombies behind this door. All right, let's do this one first then. Oh, 
Really? Puts the loot behind another locked door. It's like if the key's gonna be right there, why even do that? All right, well, good amount of loot in this room alone. So, uh, I'm happy. We got four of these left, so we'll see what else we can find. Hey, wake up. Come on, help me destroy this door. You too, buddy. Whoops, I killed that other guy. All right, that's enough. Thanks for your help. Well, we got some kerosene barrels right here. Let's be careful. Uh, yeah, we are thirsty and hungry. Let's have all this stuff. Just be a glutton. Uh, hey, wake up, lady. Help me break this door open. Look at all this loot in there. That's great. And this will be it, I guess, because these are my last two time charges. That's fine. I think we got the majority of the loot. Alright, so, um, considering there really isn't much left to do in this little crater town, I think I'm just gonna grind on base work for the next few days and we'll pick things up here on the morning of day 28 and uh, we'll fight a horde over at the mine and see how that goes and as long as we don't get buried alive then after that we will head on out to the snow biome since we haven't really spent any time there yet home sweet home for now yeah, like I said, we, we did the two big tier 5 POIs here, and we did the crazy weird rock formation thing uh, in the depths of the crater. So we're done. We'll fight a horde here at the mine, and then we'll move on to the snow biome. Granted, like I said, we don't get buried alive inside the mine. So I'm going to get working on uh, cobblestone and concrete mix materials that I'm going to need to set this base up. And that's what I'm going to work on for the next few days. And then we will pick things up here on the morning of day 28. Guys, I hope you enjoyed this episode and I hope you're looking forward to seeing more. Thank you so much for watching and all the support. You guys are the best. You can follow me on Instagram or Twitter if you want. It's at Glock9Gamer. I follow all gamers back. Come on, then. I'm in the middle of doing my outro. They never stop here, really. It's it's more of an annoyance than anything. Um, but it's all right. You know? That's just what you deal with when you live in New Jersey. Someone's always fucking wanting something from you. They're always knocking on your door. Hey, can I borrow this? Hey, how about that? I saw you just picked up that new thing. Can I have it? I'm just kidding. I uh, love you guys. See you in the next one.